awesome question I got on my YouTube channel that really probably deserves a video on its own. And I want to answer it here for you live, as well as kind of go through a couple other little announcements we have going on here. All right, so first and foremost, the question here, let me share my screen. Here we are, my screen should be sharing now. So the question came in from Stefan Heller Art asking what she likes about Teach, or he or she likes about Teachable, is they're managing the bills and the refunds and you just get money at the end of the month with a one month payment delay and they're okay with that delay. And uh, Stefan asks, how does the situation change if I integrate Thrivecart to Teachable? You've heard it's a good idea and you're planning on selling art courses. Well, first and foremost, I think it's awesome. Selling art courses is super duper cool. Um, here's a couple of differences when you're using just the default teachable system versus hooking it up to a different Thrivecart system. But before I mention that, if you guys, I'll be mentioning a reason in this video that has to do with paid advertising, which I think a lot of people are afraid of, but you really shouldn't be. And I'm teaching a free, not free, sorry, it's not free, it's a paid, it's $27 is the early bird price, a live workshop coming in the next few days. If you go to ultimatefunneltoolkit.com slash retarget, I'll go to the page here in just a second, retarget, you'll still be able to get in at the early bird price and we're gonna walk through my 10 step ad writing format that I do for every one of the ads that we run. We'll also talk about individual targeting, how you can make your targeting absolutely on point for doing ads, even if you have a very small budget how you can launch your profitable ads, even if you have zero audience or zero product, which is pretty cool. And also I'll be answering your, your individual questions. It'll be hands-on, it'll be tactical, it'll be great, and you'll have lifetime access to the replays, all right? So you'll always be able to buy it, it'll be available afterwards, but you will not get the live Q&A with me, and there are other things you'll only get beneficial if you join live, okay? So that link should be in the description, but let's go ahead and get into the answer to this question. So Thrivecart and Teachable. Thrivecart handles payments, Teachable handles payments and the actual delivery of your course area. So the question should be asked, why would you ever wanna complicate things and add an additional layer, add Thrivecart in? Um, you know, Stefan says that he or she has heard that it is a good thing to do, but why? So there's a couple things, a couple things that happen uh, with the Teachable system itself that leave a little bit on the table, okay? And um, so first and foremost, uh, Stefan mentions the delay and that you're gonna get one nice clean payment. It's almost like a paycheck, right? You, Because what happens is if somebody buys on January 1st and somebody buys on January 2nd, January 3rd, you're getting these sales every day, right? And Teachable's kind of holding onto the sales. They're holding onto them for about 30 days to make sure that anybody, if they're asking for a refund, that money is still in that reserve account and Teachable can uh, you know, give the refund money. And then at the end of the 30 days, they're gonna wait for the next billing cycle. So it could be up to 45 days before you actually get your money. And then your money comes into your bank account in one fell swoop. So it's nice because it's this like, one monthly lump sum. It's like, oh great, payday, which is good. But the downside is that can be 30 to 45 days of waiting before you actually get the funds that you earned. And that is, for me, one of the biggest reasons why I recommend adding in a Thrive Cart or some external payment processor, because what happens with these other payment processors is you'll, you're able to go and get instant payouts. And I know there's a setting with Teachable where you can get some instant payouts, but that's at their higher tier, and at that level, you should just go ahead and integrate Thrive Cart anyways. But um, the instant payouts is huge, primarily because a lot of people, when they're ready to grow their business and they're ready to scale, they want to be able to recycle their money. They want to be able to uh, spend a dollar on Monday, on an advertisement and get $2 back in revenue, which gives them a profit of a dollar, right? Very simple math there. And be able to put that additional dollar, dollar fifty back into their business and grow it. And cash flow becomes a big problem when uh, you have this long delayed cycle before you get the money back. And that for me is the biggest reason why I think having a secondary tool like a Thrive Cart is a big benefit. You get that instant payout, that money comes right back to your account and you're good to go, okay? That's reason number one. Reason number two is the Thrivecart checkout experience is just a little bit better. Uh, it's easier for you to design the checkout page exactly how you want it. You've got the drag and drop page builder of Thrivecart where you can design an upsell page and make it look exactly how you want it to. Uh, Th Teachable's page building experience and their checkout page experience, it just is not very desirable. So if you want to be launching 
a good number of products if you want to be kind of out there and look professional and have some very customized ideas of how you want to implement your checkout process that can help your conversions and it's easier to do with uh, Thrivecart compared to Teachable. All right, that's reason number two or so. Reason number three is there are features, checkout features like functionality features that Thrivecart allows you to do that Teachable does not. For two examples that come to my mind is, well, three examples now. Uh, one is on the checkout form, a very popular marketing tactic is to put a little checkbox on the form that says, hey, would you like to add this to your order? It's uh, called an order bump is what's kind of commonly known in the industry. And you cannot do order bumps inside of Teachable. You can in Thrivecart. And the beautiful thing about that is you can just write a little paragraph about what they're getting if they say yes to this little offer. And it can convert at like 30 to 50% of people that take us up on our offers also take us up on the bumps. So that increases the average order value of the cart. If they would have spent $30 on your course, they might spend $40 if you just put a little checkbox there and give them something that's very related to the product itself. All right, so order bumps are huge. And also um, upsells and downsells. Teachable can do upsells, but what happens is if they don't take you on the upsell, that's kind of the end of the process for Teachable. And with Thrivecart, you have the ability to bring in a set of downsells, which gives you kind of that last opportunity to save the sale. Uh, it's huge when you get into paid advertising to make sure you have a couple of different options, a couple of different avenues to increase that order value of the sale so that uh, your ads become profitable, your business works, and you can grow and scale. All right, so the downsells is a big feature as well. Uh, a third reason is, What's really popular, and your courses might be in this uh, in this style, is you might want to say, "Hey, the minimum price is this, but you can pay whatever you think it's worth." You kind of name your own price. So there's some really interesting features that Thrivecart gives you from a selling perspective that can make things kind of exciting. Uh, you can do name your own price. You can do donations. You can do multi bills. You can do a couple of different features that are more limited inside of Teachable. So that's another reason you could consider it. And lastly, and this is huge if you're trying to get into better traffic sources and you just haven't really unlocked that traffic uh, secret, which I think all of us are working on more traffic, is the affiliate program and the affiliate system of Thrivecart is far superior to Teachables, meaning um, you, know, you can have an affiliate program for every single product. You can have, give people the ability to give bonuses to kind of... If you have a high priced product, you don't have that much traffic, you can make all of your customers become instant affiliates and then they can go out and they can earn money and send qualified traffic over to you. It's a beautiful system. Uh, our affiliate program is phenomenal. We love our affiliates. Thank you guys for promoting all of our courses and products. And it's just an easy way for you to level up your, um, your business through additional external traffic sources, all right? So just to recap, there's a lot of benefits of adding on a Thrive Card, but let me also be fair and explain there's, I would say, probably one big con, one big negative of adding in a Thrive Card on top of Teachable. And that negative is simply complication. You know, it adds one more layer. Um, there can be some benefits in separating things, but at the end of the day, if you, you know, simplicity is very valuable. So when you're getting started, there's no need for you to go and tack on a $500, $600, $700 software on top of your existing course system. There, there's no need for that. And Teachable, it works. We've used the Teachable system alone for several years before we decided to upgrade. And uh, you know, so there's a lot of benefits in keeping things under one roof, but you will quickly see some of those limitations when you get into scaling and getting your business to go to that next level uh, where there are benefits in having the additional features, additional functions, of something that was designed just for selling. Like Thrivecart doesn't want to be a course platform, doesn't want to do page building, doesn't want to do all these other things. It wants to be a great checkout system. And so it can focus in and focus its attention on being the best of breed there and not trying to be all things for all people, which is where Teachable is kind of in that place because you can build your website on Teachable, you can host your courses, you can do your video uploads, you can do your checkout. It's kind of an all-in-one platform, right? You can even email your students. So because they have all those features, they just have more to focus on and they have to spread themselves a little thinner. So the all-in-one is a great place to start, but as you start to reach those limitations, which you will as your business grows and is successful, then tacking on Thrivecart is the easiest solution because it doesn't mean you have to abandon everything else and move everything to a new platform. You're able to kind of grow on and piece on as you go. All right, so that was a quick little uh, Q&A. I hope this was helpful. If you want to learn more with me and be 
with me live on this workshop. It's going to be a fantastic thing. It's on February 4th is when we're going live. And you can sign up at ultimatefunneltoolkit.com slash retarget. So you can see there's 21 hours left in the early bird discount. We've already had a ton of people sign up and would love to have you on the class as well. See you later. Bye.